A suspected murderer accused of taking a Detroit police officer's life is heading to trial. 7 Action News reporter Simon Shaquette is live in Detroit with that story. Simon. Stephen, the judge really put the hammer down on the defendant, telling him he will be going to trial. He did be behave bizarrely in court, as you are about to see. Also, we heard powerful testimony from witnesses there at the time of the murder. First entering a courtroom without any expression on his face, 22-year-old Marquise Cromer is facing multiple murder and gun charges. Prosecutors say Cromer shot and killed Detroit Police Sergeant Kenneth Stile back in September 2016, leaving his family with an unimaginable loss. During today's court appearance, a witness gave testimony about Cromer committing a violent carjacking, which police were responding to. The defendant told Mr. Alhadi to, quote, get the out of the car. Uh, and, and while pointing a gun at him, he was certainly in the course of attempting to commit a larceny. Despite prior efforts by Cromer's attorney to argue he was incompetent to stand trial, today the judge made it clear the trial would go on. At times, Cromer behaving disrespectfully in court, smiling and making other gestures, more signs of a lack of remorse in allegedly killing the 20-year police veteran who succumbed to a blood clot five days after being shot in the shoulder. I saw a certain uh, style running uh, across Hayes, uh, pursuing a suspect uh, into the Sunoco gas station parking lot. I, at that point, I'm telling you to put his hands behind his back. Is he complying? He's not. Cromer is also charged with shooting two other people, including his own father. He is due back in court in a week. Reporting live, Simon Shaquette, 7 Action News.